Hi guys and welcome to another video on my YouTube channel. <laughs> All right guys, so today we're gonna be doing something different. I have not been long on YouTube, but I've been a long watcher. Um, and I know, wait, can you guys see my makeup? Okay, don't look at the mess. Let's see, can you guys see my makeup here? There we go, that's much better. It's a cute little background right here. All right, anyways. Welcome guys and like I was saying I've been watching YouTube for a long long time. It's actually all I watch. I don't watch TV anymore <sighs> Only no, I really actually don't watch TV um, I watch Netflix and I watch YouTube anyways I'm rambling the point is that I've seen a lot of other plus-size bloggers and a lot of, a lot of other bloggers in general who kind of go um, into the closet I don't know what it's called like come with me in the closet, you know not like a sexual thing, not like, you know, like a gay identifying thing, but like, let's go shopping together and let's go try things on together. So let's do this. I think today we're going to be heading to Ashley Stewart <laughs> and um, we are going to be Manolo. Oh my God. He just threw up on the couch. Right, I'll be right back. Okay. No worries. He's totally fine. He just was trying to eat one of my lip liner tops and that's what he spit out anyways um we're gonna go to ashley stewart right now and we're gonna try on some cute clothes and see what not i'm also gonna be picking up some coats for a coat roundup that i'm going to be doing for you guys so i'm really excited about that and let's not waste any time and let's go Vámonos. okay guys so ooh, what does that smell all right so now we're walking towards Ashley Stewart. It's actually not too far from my house. And I just want to show you guys, I'm going by my elementary school. There's <laughs> PS 157. Rep Rep was good. Um, I actually love that school. And um, yeah, it is break up in here. Jesus, it is break. Listen, I'm a homebody. Like, I stay home if I can. If I could work from home, I would. <sighs> I don't know how people like to be out in this cold. The people playing out in these streets. We don't got time for that. Oh, Lord. <sighs> I'm just walking down my elementary school. Like, I gotta go buy it to, like, go to Ashley Stewart and all the shopping places. Oh, I hear that wind. Ooh. Anyways, guys, let me also show you my coat. This is from Simply Be. Y'all getting a sneak peek at like one of the items that I'm gonna be hauling. Y'all, I am tearing up. I, okay, so I know, people, I know a lot of y'all probably start like saying, why are you wearing in a cloudy day? The thing is that my eyes, as you guys see, are very sensitive to wind and um, to everything. So I have to kind of wear them to protect my eyes so I don't water fuck up my makeup like I'm doing right now <sighs> all right we're almost there he already has this one right here he's actually wearing in the previous video the previous clip but then I'm gonna get him this little one well, cause the only day that just so that this one's like thicker and warm and cozy so I think Friday, this is gonna be good Friday, I, I don't that. remember what um, size but oh this will have to do so Guys, I think I just want to get him a cute little toy. I like this one. Right? Where is it? That one's cute. Also, guys, I think this might be weird, but I want to get one of these little molds to just put in my beauty blender. So, what do you think? Guys, I found them. They're like four dollars, four seventy nine for this one, and then this one's three seventy nine. And then this one is $2.49. Now, I think this might be just enough because I want to be able to reach into the beauty blenders. So I might just get this one. I think I did a great hack, guys. I'm smart. Let's go. Okay, so we're here. Look, they also have a sale, a 50% off sale. So everything I get, I will be putting on my link. Uh, the link on the description below. And look at this skirt right here. So once you walk in, this is what you see. A lot of green. Nothing really that calls my attention and that goes with my style. Let's see. 
Okay, right, guys, so as we move on to the back, I see things that I actually like. First of all, this vest is super cute and warm, but let's look at this skirt right here. Yo! Drama. All right, so let me just get everything I want to try on, and then I'll meet you guys in the room. All right, guys, so before I show you guys everything that I got, first of all, I went a bit crazy. But we got some sparkles in here. Can y'all see that? Yeah, we got some sparkles, some velvet, some great ideas. Look at this. This is a sleeve. Okay. Anyways, y'all gonna get to see it all in a quick second right now. But first, let me just show you my jacket a little bit better. I know it's gonna be part of the haul. Y'all are gonna see it. But I just wanna talk about it because it looks super fucking cute and I really like it. It makes me feel like Jayla when he makes music video. She's like, I'm gonna turn the music here. enough and let's try things on okay guys so this is the first item that i'm trying on and it has these like beautiful sleeves and it's super sparkly i don't know if you guys can see it but it's extremely sparkly now here it is. here's the fit i'm actually wearing a 22 24 because i already knew that i had to size up for something that's so like you know tight in the body i'm in love with the sleeves and i'm in love that it's like an off the shoulder thing but down here, first of all, the first thing I can notice is that it's kind of see-through because you can see the black underwear. And it's a little bit, I don't know, maybe if I rise it up a little bit more. You can definitely see belly outline and all that, which not that I care that much, but not something that I want to be wearing when I wear this one right here. Maybe in black I wouldn't care that much. I wonder if they have this in black. What do you guys think? second outfit this is so glittery and i'm obsessed with it i don't know if you guys can see it as well but okay it has a little tie here in the waist it goes kind of like wide leg so i like that a lot but guys look at the floor there's so much glitter like you definitely will be dropping some gl glitter around um and this is in the size um 22 24 if i'm not mistaken i'll put the size here down below if i set the wrong size i'll check later um but yeah i actually like this a lot hold on let me see if i can there you go how cute is this definitely i'm five four guys so i'm definitely need some heels with this but i really like this this will look so good in the, the kira kira app hold up i'll be right back oh hello there look at this sparkly baby i really really love this i really enjoy this look a lot i might actually have to take this one i didn't really even bother tying this really well but whatever i just size up again anything that's like a bodysuit i always size up i usually wear 18 20 but for this i wear 22 24 because i knew that um it was going to be hugging like the stomach belly area and all of that okay i really like this this is super cute very casual <laughs> um look i like this a lot glitter everywhere if that doesn't bother you then wait let me get a better lighting if that doesn't bother you then definitely go for it but just keep that in mind you can't even see that much glitter on camera but like in the mirror there's so much glitter everywhere i don't mind it actually so this is a third look guys this is a jumpsuit it's this velvet jumpsuit which actually looks way better in camera than it does in person so looking at it in camera right here makes me be like hold on that actually looks good so what do you guys think y'all they're so loud in here this is the bonus but that's how we do we loud um 
it has that little trigger. It's actually really similar to the Lane Bryan um, jumpsuit that I tried on, but the Lane Bryan one was Y like. I wish this was Y like. I would get it again as well. What do you guys think? Yeah, so in here it has like a little band, guys, right there. It's not stretchy or anything, it's just it's just almost like you guys can see that. It's like bunched up in there. It's really cute actually, I don't mind it. I think it's gonna look better if I wear a better bra with this and once I zip it up because I can't really zip it up. But overall, I'm not mad at it. So far, let me know which one is in your favorite down in the comment section. item guys right here it's two so I have the sweats and I have a sweatshirt now this sweatshirt I as soon as I saw it because of the sleeves y'all know I love a crazy sleeve um was really cute and caught my eye and then I saw these sweats that kind of are like matching and I was like I haven't worn anything like this since like junior high school um so I just wanted to give it a try not bad I'm not mad at it I have the sweatpants in, in 1820. It's a little bit more snug right here, which I don't mind because I know this is gonna stretch out after a while. Um, the sweater is the 1920 sweat um, as well, and it fits pretty, pretty good. Actually nice and roomy. So I'm not mad at this at all. This is gonna be like a cute comfy outfit. I mean, maybe this can be like a style challenge. I have not worn like sweats. Can I make sweats look cute and like chic out in the streets? Or is it just a thing that we wear at home? Do you wear sweats outside? Like, let me know. I actually never wear sweats outside of my house. I'm not mad, y'all. I really, really, really like this sweater. Oh my god, it's super cute. How cute is this? Okay, guys, I just tried these pants and they're size 20 and they're super cute. They don't fit. I'm going to try and get them in a 22, 24. Well, let's see what happens. And I have the 26 on and it's still funny tech here in the belly area. So I might even have to do a 28 if I really like them. But quite honestly, I think they're super cute. I love the ruffle here. Like, I love that. It's like towards the front. It's dramatic. I like it. Um, I definitely would have to get it fitted. I kind of folded the hem in. But I don't know. I'm not sold on it. What I'm trying on is this button up top from Ashley Stewart. It looks better on the rack. I'm not in love with it here. But I do love the sleeve. Look at that. That's a really cute sleeve. What do you guys think? Oh, I'm also just wearing the skirt just so that I'm not, you know, naked in the, in the video. But it's pretty short. It's kind of, I don't know, I'm kind of confused. I feel like I probably would wear this, maybe with like some high-waisted pants or something like that. I just really like the sleeve. It's a sleeve, the sleeve always gets me. All right, so moving on to the next item that I have, to, not just because I have it now, but it's this skirt. I actually saw this on um, Essie. I think Essie was wearing this and it was really pretty. And then when I saw it on the rack, I was like, okay, it's not bad, kind of like it. What do you guys think? Would you wear this? It's actually really pretty with some like cute booties. Okay guys, this is the next top. Again, the sleeve. They got me. That's how they get me. That's how they get me. They get me with a good sleeve. Um, I love a dramatic sleeve. This is really cute. I'm wearing the 20, but it just did not fit. It actually unzips all the way in the back, so I have it completely open. Um, so I would definitely have to size up to a 22, 24, or probably even a 26. Um, I'm not sure. You know, it's, it just depends on every store. The sizing is completely different. So, yeah. It's cute. I actually like this a lot. I just need to get it in my size. But I just wanted to show it to you guys before I changed into the next item. And it's crop top. And y'all know I love a good crop top. I love a good crop top, y'all. Here we go. This is the next one, guys. This is like a crop top too. 
So it stops around there and I had to write, this took me like a good 15 minutes to figure out how to put this. I'm pretty sure that I put it pretty wrong, but just so you guys get the idea, this is a size 18 and it fits really well. This went around my body about two to three times before I was able to wrap it. Um, and the sleeve, you can't tell because it's kind of needs to be ironed or steamed, but it has the layers to it and I'm not going to say it anymore, but you guys know. I like a good sleep. So, I'm trying to be quiet because I feel like everyone's listening to me now. Like, the store just got so quiet every single time I start vlogging. The store gets so quiet. I feel like everyone's listening to me vlog. And, like, it's embarrassing. But whatever. All in the name of fashion. Hey there, outside people. Anyways, what do you guys think? It's not, look, I definitely fucked this up. But it fits well. And then it's a size 18. All right, this is the last top I think that I'll be trying on. It's this like cow neck, turtleneck thing going on here. And then on the sleeves, y'all, again with the sleeve, right here. That's really cute, isn't that? It's like different. I really, really like that. And it's like the small little details that make something worth getting. And again, this is a size 18, 18, 20, and I like this. Not bad. What do you guys think? So far, definitely I'm going to be going through the comment section to know which one was your favorite so that I can just go back and be like, oh, why didn't I get that? I should have gotten that. But whatever. I like this a lot. Okay, guys, the last thing I'm trying on are these little cute PJs. You can't really tell how well the color in the lighting, but it's like nice and cute and rosy. It's much pinker than it looks in camera. Um, and then it is a shorts and the top. I don't really wear PJs to go to sleep. I usually just wear like a big t-shirt. So I was like, might as well treat myself to a good PJ set and not dress naked. I mean, sleep naked or with a big t-shirt. So here we go. And they come together. They're kind of like racked together in a 3X top and a 3X bottom. So I don't know if I can um, probably go for 4X in the bottom. And the 3X is pretty big and wide and comfy. So that's fine for me. But maybe the bottom I can switch up for 4X. Let's see. Oh, wait a minute, she thought we was done. Hold up. Nah, guys. So I just wanted to show you a quick little jacket that I saw around. This one is a 22-24. It's a little snug. I definitely have to go to a 26-28 in this one. But, um, it's actually pretty cute and it's so warm. Guys, Oh, So warm. I really like this a lot. I'm going to leave you guessing. Do you think I'm going to add this to the coat roundup coming? Yes. What do you think? Alright guys, this next jacket is a cute little puffer coat. I have not run a puffer coat in a while. This one's in 22. And this one zips up. It's nice and comfortable. And I like this. I like the little panel right here. I have not. I'm so warm in this. I literally haven't worn a... Uh, Puffer jacket like this. Please so hang in the for the night. I'm embarrassing myself way too much here. Alright, and I got this little fur one, guys. It's super cute. It closes nice and comfortably, but the arms are a little snug on this one. This is a 22 24 that I'm trying on. So I might have to go to a 24 26 or 26 28. Who knows? But I like this. I got my hoops on, my furs on, I don't want to eat my Tim's and I'm good to go, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Okay guys, so I finally am sitting down here in the bench, I'm like leaning back, getting comfortable just looking at the clothes to see what sizes I'm going to be getting in each thing and which things I'm going to be getting. I'm not going to be getting everything, so. Um, I think the turtleneck with the little holes on the sides. I'm going to size down to a 1416 because I want the snugger feel, especially around the neck area. Um, thank you, I will. Um, and I really like the other sweater. I think I need to get a lot of tops because I usually just buy like bodysuits and jumpsuits because that's so easy to get dressed. You just wear that and you're out. But I want to challenge myself to be a little bit more adventurous and to try different things. Um, this top with the sleeves, I think I'm going to try and go all the way up to a 28 because it was so tight and the material is so, you know, restricting. 
anyways i'm telling you guys all of this about the sizing and i do mention the sizing because um i want uh as a plus size woman i know that the dressing room can be such an intimidating place you i just have like nightmares from dressing rooms when i was younger when i was graduating from high school i remember i came here to the same ashley stewart actually with my mom to buy myself a dress for um graduation and i ended up wearing a dress that was like a black multi-layer dress i don't have pictures i don't think i have pictures um and i remember just feeling so ugly and like like I was wearing a grandma's dress because at that point that's exactly what I was wearing was a grandma's dress and um hold on let me see if I can go to better lighting where's the better lighting there's no better lighting here <laughs> um so yeah it's just so that you whenever you go shopping by yourself or with your friends and you feel like you have so many emotional things going on like the dressing room can be like a roller coaster of emotions for a lot of people I know it used to be a lot for me but I just want you to remind to remind you guys that it doesn't matter if you have to go all the way up to size 28 or 30 if you have to go down all the way to size 14 your value as a human being doesn't change and it's all about wearing what fits you right what makes you feel comfortable and having fun because fashion is all about having fun and expressing yourself um so now i'm just gonna head out get the things that i want and i hope you guys enjoy this video i'll see you guys soon